the engagement by Britain and Somalia was led by the uh, fact that we were all of us in the cabinet appalled at the dreadful effects of the famine where tens of thousands of children under five were starving to death as a result of, of what was going on in Somalia and a determination by the British government to play its part and try to bring order and stability to a very disadvantaged and uh, difficult part of the world. That is why the Prime Minister called the conference. It was, I think, the right time to do it. Uh, and, and we did it because we are horrified by the dreadful effects of the famine, the lives of people in, uh, in, in Somalia, where a girl is more likely to die uh, having a baby than to complete her primary schooling. Um, but also, of course, Somalia, in all its dysfunctionality, is a threat. So there's no commercial imperative. No, none, none, none whatsoever. Of course, of course uh, if oil is uh, found and developed, we want that oil to work for the benefit of the Somali people. But the British government's development efforts are engaged to make sure that the money is accounted for, spent transparently, and works for the benefit of Somalis. Quite a lot of conservative MPs.